Hey guys, it's me, Yuki, and today I am going to be talking about Witty. So if you go to my old videos, there should be a whole shitload of paragraphs about him. If you guys want to know the original um, story, and if you guys want to know like everything that happened, and it's all true. It all happened all the way back in 2021 to 2022 and to 2023 <clears throat> if anyone is watching this if any of my friends are watching this um i can't go on discord because there are some issues but i will have to wait for a few days to go back on there's just some issues that's going on anyways um I decided to come up with a plan one month ago. I kept thinking about trying to get Witty into jail, but I know I can't do that because I have to go to court and I have to have a witness, like in person and not online. But that was kind of difficult for me. <clears throat> so I decided to come up with a plan and the plan was to become friends with Witty and to confess my feelings for him, even though I don't have any feelings for him. And then I made peep and then I told my friends to go along with the plan and I gave some of them specific roles to test Witty. And all of them agreed to it, but before we did that, of course, we had to vote, and there was a lot of yeses, and there was barely any noes. There was only, like, five noes, and, um, I've decided to go with the plan. During the plan, I, um, I've talked with Woody about some things, like, about why he did what he did in the past and who are these girls in his DMs why why was he talking crap about me and lying about me and what happened with um old friends of mine turns out that an old friend like a group of friends that used to be my best friends. They have, um, ghosted Witty, which is good. I tried warning Witty about that, but they never listened. I mean, he never listened to me. So these group of friends were named Bad Alien or Ramses. I used to call him Bobrowski, which was a nickname into calling him my best friend or my, my best brother. Miku or Emily. Emily Vaquez, Perry or Perito or Doge Taro, Flamingo and Phoenix, Clone Jade, Mavery and I think that's it. Oh, and Alana and Boop. All of those people that I just mentioned have done some terrible things to me, or to each other, or to other people. I will be exposing them soon, but right now I'm focused on exposing Witty. So I already know I have exposed him many, many times, but there's just something wrong about Witty. He's a, he's a cold-hearted liar. He lies to people. And as I said a couple of weeks ago, he lied to me. He made a fake apology. I've told his brothers about the situation. I told his brothers everything, every little detail, and I showed them proof. I showed them everything. And they believe me. They're, they're on my side, but they're also on their brother's side. And I've tried making them tell their parents about this, and they're their parents know, so their parents know that Woody has done these things, but their parents aren't going to do shit. 
which makes no fucking sense. Because Witty lives with them, right? He still lives with his parents, he works at McDonald's, and he pays for his own phone bill. But his parents have agreed to letting him stay there. They let him stay in their household. So that means Witty doesn't pay for their, their bills. And even if he does, that's still their house. It's not Witty's house. Witty just lives in there because that's that's his parents. And they they raised him his whole life. So he's in he is <coughs> he is entitled to stay there, but at the same time he's not. Cause after all, like he doesn't own the house. And probably his parents don't. They're probably just for rent. But like, his parents could still kick them out, kick him out if he if they wanted to, like make him live somewhere else or just live on his own. Especially since Witty is an adult now, he could do things on his own. It just makes no sense. Like, why can't they ground him or something, or just like take his phone away for a while for a while or get him into treatment. Or do something, like, do something about it. His parents are really retarded. And I know that's fucked up for me to say, but I'm telling the truth. A long time ago, I made Witty tell his dad, and his dad didn't do anything about it. His parents just don't do anything about it. And of course they wouldn't want their son to go to jail, but he deserves some kind of punishment. Like, maybe make him go to therapy, or, like... Man management classes for pedophiles or something. I don't fucking know. Why should he get away with this? This makes no fucking sense. But don't worry, I'm not letting Witty get away with this. And the reason why I said that is because I've done some things on the internet. I'm not gonna say what I've done, but Witty deserves it. He's a cold-blooded, hearted monster. And he's hurt me in the past. He's hurt my sister. And somehow my sister stands up for him. She stands up for somebody who hurt her. I don't know if there's anything I can do about it, but like, deep down I'm just, I'm just sick. Woody makes me sick. He's a sick man. I fucking hate Woody. I don't care if my parents or my school or anybody sees this. Deep down, I have hatred for Woody. I don't forgive him at all. I will never forgive him and I don't care what his brothers say. His brothers told me to just leave him, leave him alone. Same with my sister. But I didn't. I don't want to leave Witty alone. But I don't want to talk with him either. I don't want to talk to that sick bastard. If any of my friends are watching this, some of you have told me to leave me to leave Liddy alone. I'm sorry, but I'm not gonna do that. What he's done to me, and what he's done to my sister, and everybody that I knew, that it's just, it affected me for three years now, and I can't let go of it. And he still does this bullshit. He still hurts people and lies to people. Why should I fucking let him get away with it? Somebody's gotta fucking stop him. And it's gonna be me. If any of my friends are watching this, you can talk to me on Twitter or on Roblox or on TikTok. Cause right now I can't go on Discord. And... 
there is a specific person that I want to talk to. Um, Leo. So if any of you guys can tell Leo to contact me on any social media, please, please do so. Um, all of my socials will be in the description. So that way you can contact me. Or you can even contact me on YouTube. But just so you know, everybody will be seeing our messages on there. Or like, yeah. Because <clears throat> right now I can't get on Discord. So, yeah. Anyways, you all have a good day. I hope you all understand about the situation. And I don't need to expose Witty anymore because I have all the evidence. I've explained multiple times. Oops, sorry for the stupid notification. And, um, yeah, that's all I have to say. Goodbye.